Um, hello, everybody. I'm Simon Dutton. I'm based in North Wales in the UK. I want to tell you about why Lego Series Play is the perfect fit with project management. So what I want to do is just explain what I've done in that 44 years. The first 10 was in the branches and then the following 34 years have been um, doing things in the project world. So um, this explains why I think I'm a little bit qualified to write the handbook practical guide on project, project management and Lego series play. What I want to do before we talk about Lego series play is talk a little bit about what is a project. Um, let's then take a look at what a project looks like. And you'll get bits of this right through today. So when you look at a project and the people that are involved, there are lots of different roles, lots of different people and lots of different skills. The first person over on the left hand side is the sponsor. That's the person that holds the money for the project. Then you have a project management team. There might be a program manager and that's someone who looks after lots of projects, all delivering to the same purpose. So that's the sort of people that we would deal with in our workshops. And I'm not going to make any apology for this next slide. Um, this says when we should use um, Lego series play. It's, it's a complex subject. Um, there's, you need to get the big picture, see the connections, explore solutions. So what's in this practical guide? Um, there's an introduction to LSP and project management, why we should use series play, the team roles that I've just mentioned and when they should attend different workshops. I've got six workshop roadmaps and the supporting materials, when to run them, how to apply LSP. Um, and I talk then a little bit about skills building, some hints and tips. And, and finally, um, something that's not project related, but I find it very, very useful is something called pair analysis, which you can use to evaluate ideas. So when do we apply Lego series play? I want to give you just a, a few uh, ideas of the sort of things that come out of these workshops. So from generating ideas, this would turn into a, an idea for a project where the onboarding process, bringing people in, new colleagues into the business is, is complex and is difficult to follow. And as we know with Lego Series Play, when you put this sort of model in front of people, they can understand immediately what the issue is. Communication workshops are really important unless you have people talking properly, um, the project will fail. 35% of projects fail because of poor communication. The, the pre-mortem workshop, if you take that into the issue resolution, so there's your, your, your gap. We talk about the post-implementation review and we ask what went well, what didn't go well. <clears throat> so that's the, the essence of the guide. Um, I'm happy to take questions uh, in just a moment when we move across to the, um, the, the, the chat arena. Um, the guide is now available on the LSP magazine web shop. Uh, I'm very grateful to Michelle and his team for helping get that out so, so promptly and, and ready for today. Um, there we are. I think I've come in under time. <laughs>